Yeah, hi guys. So let's look at this uh, another question from CAT two zero two one slot one uh, from percentage profit loss chapter. Okay, this question says that identical chocolates, ah, uh, chocolate pieces are sold in boxes of two sizes, small and large. The large box is sold for twice the price of the small box. Okay, so large box is sold for twice the price of a small box. If the selling price per gram of chocolate in the large box is twelve percent less than the less than that in the small box. Then the percentage by which the weight of the chocolate in the large box exceeds that in the small box is nearest to which value uh, among these options? Okay, so now let's solve this. Yeah. So what we'll be thinking is, we uh, will assume selling price of that uh, large and a small back boxes. It is given L is equal to twice of S actually. Okay, so because there is no concrete data in this question, all the uh, values are in percentages. Ah, uh, there is no rupees mentioned, nothing like that. Okay, so what I can actually do is. Assume anything because it uh, whatever I assume it won't uh, it won't have any importance in the long run in this question. Okay, so what I can see that uh, let the selling price I'll take uh, I'll assume that selling price of the large boxes of the large box. Okay, uh, large box of chocolates is equal to I can assume some rupees twenty or some rupees two hundred anything. The ratio should be two is to one, right? And selling price of a small box of chocolates. Okay, so a small box of chocolates. I'll assume to be rupees hundred. That's fine. Okay. Now also, I don't know the quality. What what uh, quantity these uh, these uh, boxes contain? Okay, so I'll I'll assume that large box contains some L gram of chocolates, है ना? And a small box contains some S gram of chocolates. Correct. So now what what is written here is. Uh, if the selling price per gram of chocolate in the large box is twelve percent less, so how to form this equation, guys? Okay, so selling price it is saying per gram of chocolate. So if the price is rupees two hundred, and if it contains l gram, the selling price per gram contains two hundred by it becomes two hundred by l, correct, right? So large box or uh, the selling price of large box I have assumed to be two hundred rupees. And it contains l gram of chocolates. So what is selling price per gram? Two hundred by l. Okay. Now is is equal to twelve percent less than. So twelve percent less than that in the small box. Okay. So small. What is the what is the per gram chocolate in this cost in small box? So selling price of a small box is hundred rupees, and it contains s gram chocolate. So per gram cost is hundred by s. Okay. And basically, this data is twelve percent less than this, right? So twelve percent less than this means this should be this uh, this should be equal to eighty-eight percent, है ना? So basically, I I can write like this here. So hundred by s eighty-eight percent of hundred by s because twelve percent less, so I can write eighty-eight percent of hundred by s. What is hundred by s here? That is selling price per gram of a small box of chocolates. Okay. And why eighty-eight percent? Because this price this cost is twelve percent. Less than this cost. That's my equation here. Again, let's solve it. Okay, so let's let's just solve it, guys. So now, two hundred by L is equal to eighty-eight by hundred into hundred by S. Hey na? Now this gets cancelled here. Okay. So what ratio uh, I can get from here is so I can solve like uh, L by S. Okay. So L by S will be equal to two hundred by eighty-eight. So I can just cancel by eight. Eight twenty-five ja and eight eleven ja, so I can get L by S equal to twenty-five by eleven. So what they are asking is, then the uh, the percentage by which the weight of chocolate in the large box exceeds the smallest box, right? That means large box now it is twenty-five. Okay, a small box is eleven. I assumed is L gram and S gram, right? Yeah. So how much more it is here? How much more it is? So I can just solve that. It is actually fourteen more, right? Yeah. So how much more it is? Fourteen by eleven into hundred. Correct. That's the that's the uh, that that uh, by this much it exceeds in percentage. No, it is eleven. It is twenty five. So fourteen by eleven because eleven to twenty five I'm calculating, not twenty five to eleven. Okay. So large box exceeds by uh, a small box. Okay. Had it been opposite, a small box uh, is less than the large box. Then you can do by do do like fourteen by twenty five. Okay. So now fourteen by eleven into hundred. So I can just write. Okay. So basically I can write like this. One plus three by eleven, है ना? Now one means what? One means hundred percent, okay? And three by eleven. So I know that one by eleven 
is some 9.09 percentage है ना by percentage table so 3 by 11 will be how much 27.27 percent so what is the answer answer will be 127.27 percent that's the answer so I can mark option uh, A here that's the correct answer okay so you follow you got this question right yeah thank you